and peace will come to this country. We want absolute peace. Not only peace. He said in Baragran there is no peace. Oh. Uh -huh. uh, distinguished Nigerians, please permit me to stand on a really established protocol. The wife of the Minister of Health City, we thank you for gathering us here. You know, the mother of the nation doesn't come to a place that is not organized. She's very peaceful. And she's always going with women. That is the only thing I like with her. Small time, they say, hey, women make trouble. Men, don't you people make trouble? Uh -huh. So you see, there will be peace in her house, peace in her neighborhood, peace in Nigeria on the whole. That's what we are supposed to preach, and we preach, and we continue to preach. Two years ago, what a coincidence. The first lady was in a, a function where the next day was my birthday and tomorrow will be my birthday i will be 72 tomorrow and all of you here will pass 72 and you will have food to eat as i'm eating you will see your children children as i've seen my own i always don't tell me it's one minute uh -huh. so what i'm saying you see they say you shouldn't throw stone in the market market is the best place to stay in market, we have all tribes. Don't throw stone in the market. Don't throw stone in Nigeria. You don't know it will affect you. It will affect your townsmen. It will affect your village people. It will affect your friends. Please and please and please, let peace reign in this country. I like peace. Why I'm telling you this? You see, we don't like war. I've seen Hitler war. Yes. I've seen Nigerian Biafra war. I don't want to see any peace. Oh. If there is a problem, you will eat in uh, local jar. That local jar. You will never see peace in Jesus' name. Nobody in Nigeria. No, eh, I don't make mistake, my man. There will be peace. Amen. And we must all have peace. Amen. Our mother of the nation, we thank you. You, she, you see, she's laughing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she's always going along with us. You see why I like the minister of uh, the wife of the minister look at the area she's touching have you seen the area she's touching we are living temporary here i cannot where i'm marching to now is less than where i've marched anything you do in this world you must be answerable so it's better we live happily here and manage our life and be happy forever look at the area she has touched the day she was talking with me, I felt cold. She said, we have to clean where we rest forever. Can you imagine that? Where we rest forever. So we have to build ourselves to walk towards that so that we have, we stay forever in love. This world, don't you see somebody who said, in this world we are passing through. What is that man's name? In the, we are passing through. We are passing through. And uh, Julius Caesar said, that is a necessary end. The wife of the minister of First City has taught that. So we have to be very, very, very careful. So that we live well and end forever. May God bless Nigeria. And I have not finished. Oh. I have not finished. In the Constitution of Nigeria, Section 24, it is boldly written there that everybody has a part to play. Let us play our part. Not everything, President. You don't give your, uh, you don't go to the toilet. That ah, is the president who doesn't allow me to go to the toilet. We have role to play. All of us will play that role. Can we play that role well and live well and be happy with ourselves, be happy with our family, be happy with the whole nation? May God bless us all. Mama, thank you. Thank you, ma. Thank you.